A church clock in pont a which has been famous for its unreliability, is working to time and chiming again. It's the town clock, the church tower timepiece of St Catherine's Church. It often went too quickly, it often didn't go at all, but now you can hear it chiming accurately every quarter of an hour. Our Valley's reporter, Kate Scott-Williams, has been to the church to find out more. <laughs> This chime's not been heard for years. Quite how many, no one really knows. For Reverend Marcus Green, the vicar here at St Catherine's, he says the best guess they have is around 25 years. There are people and members of the church who remember it from then, but they argue how long it's been. I mean, one says it's been the 50s, uh, that's not half a century. Um, and another says, no, he was bell ringing when it last happened, and that would have been in the early 80s. So we honestly don't know, and no one can particularly accurately remember. So here we are, this is the clock itself. Glorious brass mechanism. It's 1890, here's the date on it there. Uh, it says manufactured in Croydon. Reverend Green says to describe the clock as temperamental was something of an understatement. There were a whole series of problems with it, but the main one was with the hands outside. Over the years, the weather batters them and the wind twists them, and they were just off true. And because of that, this is then having to pull an enormous amount of weight. And over there, there are huge weights hanging down, and they were far too big for the size of clock. And what had happened is, in order to make it run right over the years, people just put more and more weight on it to make it run properly. And so, from time to time, it would run fast, and then it would run slow, and then it would just be ridiculous. And people in town would look at this clock and go, I wonder what time it is. But no more. Reverend Green got Ron the Kenentaf Council on board as the clock was donated to the people of pont by some locals in 1890. And now they've had the mechanisms repaired, much to the delight of those in pont I've been sung you for 10 years, catching the bus, and it's nice to hear it again. Yeah, it's a good thing. I mean, I can see it at the clock from my house. It's nice that after 25 years it is now working. And it's a nice feature of pont so very happy. I like it. Can you hear it from the garden? Yeah. It's nice, yes, I've been here. Now it's back, you realise you've missed it. When it chimes now, it's, oh, it's beautiful. No one was more pleased than 86-year-old Lewis Jones. I used to sit up on the Greg Mountain and you could always hear the church bells, you know. Now that's the way we used to judge the time when we was up the mountain, you know, listening to the bells. Really? So how yeah. many years going back is that? Oh, 40 years. I heard it strike 11 now and I thought, that's lovely. You the clock back on. <laughs> Reverend Green, he's just hoping the repairs last and the town can keep enjoying the clock's chimes for many more years to come. A church is all kinds of things, but we are to make people's lives better. And actually doing something like this says, this is what we're about. Uh, no complaints from anyone that the chimes are back at nice and loud? No, anything but. I was frightened of that, actually, because first thing I did the first morning after they'd been ringing all night was I went to the neighbours and said, is it all right? And actually I got from them, we loved it. What happened? It was great. So, you know, brilliant. Oh, it's a thing of beauty. And um, those of us who live <laughs> within a few yards of it are very glad to have it back in working order. Kate Scott-Williams reporting from St Catherine's Church in Pontypridd.